I'm Mike Elliott, and you're watching the CEO Live Investor Update Series. Today, we're joined again by Mr. Alex Sheed, CEO Asia of Pacific Green Technologies, ticker PGTK. Pacific Green is focused on addressing the world's need for cleaner and more sustainable energy. The company's strategy is to build through organic development and acquisition, a portfolio of patented, competitive, cutting-edge technologies designed to meet increasingly stringent environmental standards. Good morning, Alex. Uh, Welcome back to the show. I appreciate you taking the time to join us again following last week's interview, as I know you only arrived last night uh, from signing the first order through the JV with Power China. No problem, Mike. Nice to be here. And last week, you explained it had been a, a really a long journey, two years, in fact, I think, uh, in getting to the signing of the JV. Um, how did you find the process of getting an order uh, compared to that? Well, I think this is a, this is a major turning point uh, for the company, signing this order. Um, I think the hardest part has been the uh, evaluation of the technology um, in China. So we spent, as you said, two years um, with uh, design technology institutes, uh, these are state-owned institutes that evaluate um, the uh, international technologies for best in class. And Power China came to the conclusion that of all the, of, uh, essentially three for three reasons uh, that we were um, that they wanted to go ahead with us. And one was the fact that uh, we were the most efficient and we could uh, remove the most uh, pollutants from flue gases. The second one was through our design. Um, our patented design, um, we're smaller and therefore we're cheaper to build and flexible for retrofits. And thirdly, and probably the most interesting one for China was that uh, we um, are cheaper for the end user, the, the power plant owner, for operating costs. Um, so it's incredible to see Power China um, closing this deal. It was uh, quite humbling actually to be a part of the process. Um, this is a uh, Steelworks client of theirs. Um, they're building the, uh, the the whole plant for them. Uh, this is phase one of, uh, of three phases. Um, so it's been an incredible uh, start to the year for us. Um, we've opened some offices with them. We've employed a reputable um, head engineer. Um, we're quoting on 4,400 megawatts of power. Uh, this is uh, 93. Our first order is a 93 megawatt um, uh, order. Um, it's uh, 10 million RMB, which is uh, just over one and a half million US. Um, so it's, it's a relatively small start, but uh, if you extrapolate out the figures, you can see the sort of opportunity uh, we're looking at. And above all, we wanted something that we could uh, have up and running very quickly. So Power China uh, and ourselves wanted to have a project that our customers could come and uh, look at and evaluate, uh, whether it's the data or, uh, um, uh, or actually sort of walk around the plant. Um, so we'll be up and running by September 16. Um, and I think that another key point for us is the versatility of our of our technology. So this is a combustion gas um, plant, and um, uh, we are obviously mainly quoting on coal. But it just shows with different there's different uh, opportunities we can with our our, our technology. Um, and we're looking our next couple of projects are very high sulfuric coal projects, which are our competitors have been <clears throat> unable to uh, to remove sufficient uh, pollutants, so they've uh, called us in to have a look at it. I can imagine there's a number of other competitors, but you've established this relationship with Power China. You've now received the first order, so um, the technology's proven, the relationship is built. Um, you know, what else do we need to know about the, the market uh, and, and maybe, you know, how just how big a problem the pollution in China is right now? Yes, well, I mean, it's a, you know, it's a very good point. I think it's very easy to uh, to look at China, say the big polluter, they're not really doing anything about it. But they've introduced um, uh, very, very strict um, uh, emissions control limits. So they've introduced 35 uh, milligrams per cubic meter. Just to give you some idea, 10 years ago, that limit was 400 um, milligrams per cubic meter. So they're really doing something about it. The U.S. are trying to regulate to this sort of level. Um, I mean, it's a, it's a well-known fact that in China, um, there's 4,000 premature deaths every day due to pollution. I think as part of uh, Chairman Xi's legacy, he wants to create an environment where the Chinese are healthy, they want to live in the country, and they want to stay there. So there's absolutely no doubt um, that something is happening. They are, um, it, it's a, it's a, their biggest industrial problem, um, and it's very exciting for us to be, um, to be a part of it. And as far as the remainder of uh, 2016 goes, now that this process has started, do you anticipate or are you able to talk about at this point, this juncture, any any forthcoming future orders or uh, do we just have to wait and, and see? 
Well, there's definitely uh, there's a huge pipeline of business, yeah. um, um, and um, you know we're working through through the process. But um, we see this uh, as a uh, you know a huge opportunity. There is uh, um, probably not a bigger market for us anywhere in the world. Um, and, um, you know, and we've cracked it and, you know, quite frankly, couldn't be happier um, with the situation we're in. And I think if we dovetail our, um, uh, our know-how, our IP, our technology, and we have the manufacturing capability and prowess of Power China, then uh, we're a potent force throughout China and also throughout Asia. And Alex, that's all the questions we have for today. Anything else investors need to know right now? Um, I think just, um, you know, we're, we're just going to continue... Um, pushing for um, for orders um, and, um, and 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 uh, off the back of Power China, whenever they build, whenever they retrofit, um, we are the emissions control solution um, for for their clients. Well, Alex, thanks again for your time. Again, this uh, congratulations, an impressive achievement. You know, after two years getting the signed joint venture, and now to get the first actual order, so that um, there's revenue flowing back from that joint venture, very impressive. And we're going to continue to follow the story closely, and and hope to have you on our show again soon for, for another update. Thank you very much, Mike. Thank you. You've been watching CEO Live TV, and we have been talking to Mr. Alex Sheed, CEO Asia of Pacific Green Technologies, ticker PGTK. To learn more about Pacific Green, please visit their website at www.pacificgreentechnologies.com. Thank you for watching CEO Live TV.